Fearful of losing support, Macron rallies supporters. This month's French election might be a disaster for President Emmanuel Macron, who has warned that the far-right rise and expectations of lower-than-expected voter participation have put his chances of victory in jeopardy. Right-wing nationalist Marine Le Pen, who lost to Macron in the presidential runoff by a margin of 66% to 34% five years ago, has tightened the gap recently, forcing the incumbent centrist to offer a rallying call to supporters in the closing days before they travel to the polls. Because of Le Pen's anti-EU and anti-NATO stances, and her desire to deny immigrants access to free healthcare, social benefits, and employment, the 44-year-old feels a Le Pen triumph would set Europe back. A Harris Interactive survey released on Wednesday showed support for Macron at 51.5% and Le Pen at 48.4% if the two made it to the second round. After losing two points in the first round of voting in the last week, Macron is still aiming to become the first president to win a second term for 20 years. He currently has 26.5% of the vote, while Le Pen, the national rally's leader, has a two-point advantage at 23.3%. Ahead to the first round, surveys predicted Macron would win Le Pen in a runoff on April 24, 54% to 46%. Before Russia invaded Ukraine his approval ratings were over 35%, and his current language demonstrates that he now takes the danger seriously. On the heels of his victory in the 2017 presidential election and the Brexit vote of 2016, Emmanuel Macron stated this week that unexpected outcomes may occur.